Well, hello guys, welcome back to another video. Um, in today's video, we will be doing a budget with me for my third paycheck of March. I think it's my third. <laughs> <laughs> my third paycheck of March. So if that's something you want to see, just keep on watching. All right, let's hop right into it. So, um, the paycheck, I just got it. So we're going to zoom a little bit out. And the paycheck date will be 3-17-23. And we received, um, or was budgeting for $1,237, I believe. And that is, oops. And that's all that we're getting. Right. I'm gonna go ahead and fill in. Travel. Oh, man, already. Travel pay. Oh, uh, night. I know. Horrible. Um, but we'll get right into bills here. So for the 17th, we have my car payment coming out. But I saved a portion of it last week, so we only have to contribute to 75 to it. And I forgot about a bill last week, so it would have been just $200, but I forgot that my State Farm came out. I don't know why I did not write that on my my monthly um, spread. Usually that's where I just kind of keep track of my bills but I just didn't do it that was weird anyway Verizon's getting 52 that's due on the 21st and stars and peacock they actually come out of my Apple account um, every month and so they kind of come out around the same time so I just kind of budget for them together um, that's $12 and then we have um, my savings transfer that I'm going to keep doing until I reach the amount that I need for my annual bills for the next year or for this year is $100 and then for food and gas. Um, for food, we're going to do $120, and then for gas, we're going to do $100. That's been working for me. All right, so we're going to add all of this up really quickly. So we have a total of six fifty nine in bills. All right, and if you subtract that from the the paycheck, we are going to be cashed up in five seventy eight. Budget for cash stuffing, 578. We're gonna make it work. I mean, we did make it work. Since this video is kind of pre-planned, otherwise, like I, I always say this, it would be hella long if I did not do that. Cause it takes me forever to figure out where this stuff is gonna go. I just keep moving it around until it works for me. But okay, personal. Personal is only gonna get it 10. This time, there's not anything that I need, I don't think, so we're not going to put much in there. Medical is getting 50 because my medication is not working for me, and I let the doctor know. Um, she just hasn't gotten back to me about what she's going to switch me to because it's, I mean, my sugar is sky high, 
even on the medication, it's it's sky high. And usually it's not that high unless I'm not on anything, I'm not taking any any medicine. So we're gonna get that fixed, and she's probably I recommended that she put me on insulin, but we'll see. Um so my car envelope is getting twenty dollars. That'll I think get it up to over four hundred. Clothing is gonna get ten. Um, planning, everything's gonna get the minimum. <laughs> and my priorities were moving and vacation and um, my 5K challenge. So that's where I put most of my money towards. And eating out gets 40. All right. Um, food stock. I don't know if I've mentioned this but this is also for like if my mom asked me to run to the store to get something in it and I didn't really budget for it and I've already kind of gotten my food for the week and spent the money and now I'm like crap I don't know if I have it this is where I would pull that money from food stock gaming is getting $10 this is us is getting 10. Um, Titus is getting whatever's in my wallet. So it's, he is getting something cause I make sure I have ones at the end of every week. Gifts is getting three dollars. That's what I had after I did everything else because it's not a priority. Emergency fund is getting fifty dollars. Um, so I'll try to hit a thousand in there. Once I hit it, OMG! I'm gonna be gonna move that fifty somewhere else. Vacation is getting 50, it's lol, cause I really wanted to put 150 in there, I really did. All right, um, moving on to travel. Travel is going to be getting $20 and education is getting five, not a priority. Birthday is getting five as well. And business is also gonna be getting five, um, not a priority. Um, now, on to some bigger and better things. 25 for moving. That's what I'm wanting to put in there every week. The 5K home challenge is going to be getting a whopping 150. And future is going to be getting five. Three, uh, three months ahead, we'll be getting 10. And Christmas. It's going to be getting 25. That's my minimum for there. 52 week, my minimum is 50. So that's what that's getting. And that is the budget. Nothing for travel. I mean, nothing for uh, spending because I just don't have it. <laughs> I don't have the money to spare for spending, but it's, I mean, I've been getting by, so we're fine. We're fine. So let's go ahead and add up these numbers here. So we are up to 578. Um, we do cash stuff food. So we're going to add food into that. All right, we're up to 698. But I forgot to say this earlier. Um, because 
we are going to the movies um, tomorrow, so I need to keep that $40 and eating out in there to pay for a movie ticket. So um, I'm going to subtract that from here. And we get, oh, wait, was, is, that, is that right? Let me add it back. <gasps> Let me add it back. Is it six ninety eight? Yes, six ninety eight minus the forty dollars is six fifty eight. So let's go back in. We will be cash stuffing six hundred and fifty eight dollars tomorrow. All right, guys, that's the video. Um, thank you so much for watching and tuning in every single week for these budget with needs. I do not like to make them long, just because you know it's just. It's, it's a very simple, straightforward video. There's no need for me to draw it out and make it long. Um, I don't like long financial videos anyway. I lose, I lose uh, interest. But anyway, um, thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you like the video and you want to see more. And I'll see you in the cash stuffing. Bye, guys.